Hello everyone, welcome to Pediatrics and Neonatology. This video is about metachromatic leukodystrophy. Metachromatic leukodystrophy is an autosomal recessive neurodegenerative disorder. It is due to deficiency of lysosomal enzyme aryl sulfatase A. The defective gene is located on the chromosome 22. It has a variant which is due to deficiency of saposin B. Next is onset. The most common form is infantile form which usually begin at 18 to 24 months of age. However, there are also juvenile and adult forms. Early manifestations of metachromatic leukodystrophy include incoordination, gait disturbance and general developmental regression. Now the visual disturbance. In metachromatic leukodystrophy, there is optic atrophy and this can lead to decreased visual fixation. There may be nystagmus. Now the somatic finding. There is usually macrocephaly in the infantile form of metachromatic leukodystrophy. And the motor findings. There is upper and lower motor neuron lesion signs. There is also ataxia. Seizures are infrequent in this neurodegenerative disorder. Next is laboratory studies. There is elevated cerebrospinal fluid protein, increased urine sulfatide, and specific enzyme deficiency in the leukocytes and cultured skin fibroblast. On imaging studies, there is diffuse white matter disease. Now the clinical course of the metachromatic leukodystrophy is moderately slow. In the infantile form, death usually occur by 3 to 8 years of age and in juvenile form, death can occur by 10 to 15 years of age. Now hematopoietic stem cell transplantation is an experimental treatment. Ok friends, thanks for watching. Please like, share, comment and don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel for more informative health related videos.